On 5th September 2017, journalist Gauri Lankesh was shot dead outside a residence in Bengaluru. A journalist who has worked in many organizations, Gauri was a voice against fascism, communalism and state overreach in Karnataka. The police found that Gauri was killed by a group of criminals with links to the Hindu fundamentalist group Sanatan Sanstha. So why did the Sanatan Sanstha choose Gauri as a target? The police believe that it links back to a video of a speech made by Gauri criticizing Hindutva groups. And for the first time, we have accessed the video of that speech. <laughs> In the speech, Gauri questioned a Hindu radical group asking what kind of Hinduism they believe in. She questioned the scriptures in the religion and the origin of the religion itself. She also compared it to other religions. But it was this portion of the clip that was used to whip up anger against Gauri and make her the prime target. But activists who closely work with Gauri say there's a context to her speech. The speech was made in August 2012 in Mangaluru, days after a Hindu radical group had attacked a group of young people celebrating a birthday. In the speech, Gauri was questioning this group and them using religion as a justification for violence. The special investigation team probing the murder found this video on the cell phone of one of the killers. The trial in the case is currently underway at the City Civil and Sessions Court in Bengaluru. A forensic analysis of the video was done by the non-profit newsroom Forbidden Stories and Princeton's Digital Witness Lab. They found that the video was spread widely on Indian far-right groups and it painted Gauri as an anti-Hindu well before the assassination plan was hatched. The researchers found evidence of at least eight YouTube videos that were shared widely on Facebook, including three of them, which had more than 100 million interactions. Forbidden Stories found that the official BJP page in Karnataka had also shared the video with a warning that a befitting reply will be given the next time. In the 10,000-page charge sheet that was filed in the case, police have detailed how Amol Kale, a mechanical engineer from Pune, brought together a team of assassins to kill Gauri Lankesh. We at the News Minute have done a three-part story examining the police findings and the legacy of Gauri Lankesh. Log on to thenewsminute.com to read these stories. Thank you for your support till now and do become a member.